Nitty Gritty. Hello and welcome to Nitty Gritty. My name is Nora Adibola Osegali. At Nitty Gritty, we talk practical details about issues of life to refine you and make you a better person. Today on the program, I'll be sharing with you four ways to deal with your defiant or oppositional toddler. Who is a toddler? A toddler is a child. 12 to 36 months that is one to three years of age and toddler is derived from the word to toddle okay to toddle means to walk on steadily like children of this age this year's a great time of cognitive emotional and social development it's also important to know that some toddlers tend to be more oppositional okay than others especially kids whose emotional reactions are big and intense and kids who are more cautious and timid so i'm sharing with you four ways to deal with your deviant or oppositional toddler number one is understand your age and the peculiarities and know that it is a toddler's job to be oppositional okay this age is actually it's a period in their life when they come to understand that they are a separate entity from you and they want to exert control over their own world so you see why they tend to be oppositional number two is pay no attention to their tantrum okay tantrum is actually uh, uncontrolled outburst of anger and frustration peculiar to toddlers okay so when they do that pay no attention to the tantrum instead pay attention okay to what you want to correct in that child okay what you want to deal with in that child okay instead of paying attention to the tantrum because if you do you might actually mercilessly beat that child okay for instance you can divert the child's attention to another thing or talk about something on totally related okay like if your one year old wants to connect your phone and play with it and smash it on the floor you can actually say oh look at that thing just divert that child's attention and trust me kids mind are so frail and they're just simple to handle okay number three is set limits and stand by it always tell your child ahead of time what you want him or her to stop okay before actually stopping him from doing that particular thing okay for instance you want to take your child to bed at night and he or she is playing okay you can say Darian in 10 minutes time you'll be going to bed okay so try to soft pedal and wind up your play he or she may not come to understand at the beginning but over time he will know and understand that when mommy or daddy says in 10 minutes time okay you're going to bed he will understand that in the long run okay so always set limit and stand by it also you must be able to teach and train your child to obey you okay and make him understand that obedience attracts positive rewards and disobedience attracts punishment okay such as denial deprivation and sometimes some strokes of the cane number four which is the last is avoid giving in avoid giving in to your child's tantrum if you or she notices that when anytime she throws a tantrum and you give in okay anytime she does that she pushes you too hard and gets what she wants then every time she begins to use that tool on you and you will not be able to enforce or you know and limit the next time so do not give in avoid giving in to your child tantrum i hope you enjoyed this video and love to don't forget the first is to understand their age and the peculiarities and know that it is a toddler's job to be oppositional number two is pay no attention to their tantrum and number three is set limit and stand for it and four is avoid giving in hope you love this video do try it and let me know if it works for you thanks a whole once again for watching this video do like and share this video also subscribe to this channel if you have not done so and hit notification bell so that you get notified anytime we upload videos thanks a whole lot once again my name is Nora Adebola and this is Nature Gritty.